Hey guys, welcome back to CF Tesla. I'm Cody, and today we're going to talk about something that my wife and I really thought a lot about. Now before we get started, if you guys could do me a favor, go right down there and click that subscribe button. That would help me out a lot. My goal has always been to build a channel that has a thousand subscribers. I would love your guys' help with that. And obviously at the end of this video, if it's useful, if it's interesting, if in some way I entertained you in any way, please hit that like button for me. That would mean a lot. All right, now here's the problem. We have three kids and all three of them are in car seats. And the question that we had was, can you put three car seats in the back of a Model 3? And if it can be done, is it something you even want to do? So let's talk about that for a second. We had only ever put the three car seats into our MDX and my old Infiniti. Both were large SUVs. So now trying to fit them into this small space really got us nervous. And when you look at the sides of these, they have these round kind of side cushions here. They don't just go straight in, which means that the car seats, we were nervous we're gonna kind of angle them there. So this was a big concern of ours. And the other thing was, can you even reach the seat belts? So you might be asking, if you have three kids and you're going to be putting them in the back of your car, why would you buy white seats? Well, the simple answer to that is, I think it looks really awesome and I wanted it, so that's what I bought. And so the question is, how do we keep the car protected then from feet all over the seats and getting mud all over that with soccer practice and cleats and everything else that comes along with kids and their nasty little hands touching everything? How do we protect the car? Let me show you. And by the way, all the products I'm about to show you guys right now, I'll put down in the description below so you can go on to Amazon and read about them, read reviews later. In a future video, I'm going to do a comprehensive what I've done with all my accessories for this car and get into more detail about how I actually feel about them, how well they actually work. But for now, I'm just going to show you how I get three kids in here and how I protect my car. And of course, my first concern was these white seats. How do I protect them from indents of the car seat before I tried fitting them in? And how did I protect them from all the grubby stuff that kids drop in the dirt? Well, here's how. I bought this thing. I think it's made for dogs, to be honest. Uh, but it seems to work pretty well. It's like a big seat cover. And all you got to do with this thing, super cool, lay it down flat like this. These things come up and hook over the seat like this. It's got a little spot here to tuck that in. Put this one over this seat like that. Look at that. Just covers everything. So in terms of protecting my seats, I believe that one's checked. Now the next question was, how do I protect the back of these seats? Here's my solution for that. Okay, so I was able to find these incredible, after lots of searching, little back seat protectors and look at the quality i mean they are they are great they're nice there's a little pocket here and these are made just for the model 3 so there's a lot of generic ones online that just kind of look like great big like towels you hung over the back of your seat but not these look how nice these look and watch how easy they are to install Now keep in mind, I'm going to go into a much more detailed explanation about all these in a coming up accessory video. So if you're subscribed and you got that, that bell notification on, you'll see that video when it comes up because you don't want to miss these. Now, we've solved for the seat, we've solved for the driver and passenger seat. Now, how about that floor? Yep, you guessed it. All weather mud mats. And let me tell you, they are amazing. All right, now let's recap where we're at here. Protected 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 next up can you fit those car seats in and what are the challenges with that so what we have here is we have two boosters and we have one um, actual car seat for our youngest so the two boosters are fairly wide and the car seat is a little bit narrower so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the car seat in the middle that's heavier and run the seat belt through the back. And then we're gonna keep the other two on the outside so it'll be easier to reach and clip over. Let's see how this works. 
Now, I will say this about the back seats of these Model 3s, is that they have lots of headroom, and they're also very built for car seats. Actually, all three of these seats have clips for the right kind of car seat in the back, but I'm not gonna be using those here. I also will say this, take a look at this. They also, back here, have little latches to snap three different car seats on as well. Definitely has the hardware. Does it have the functionality? Let's get this one clipped in. Oh, and I'll point out, inside this protector, they also have little holes to bring the seat things out of. So over on this side then is the seat belt that I need. So the first step is to pull it out of here and get it ready. Okay, one in. Okay, so I put the second car seat in here, but I'm gonna save you a bunch of trouble right now because take a look at this. Look at how tight that is in there. So to get to that seat belt, you had to pull and then you try to go down in there and look. You can't even see the actual seat belt thing is through that hole and then back that way. So what was happening was we were scratching the back of our hands and it was just brutal. In fact, we were just like, this is not gonna work. But we came up with a solution. Seat belt extenders. These little puppies have taken something that was an absolute nightmare and made it absolutely no problem at all. Now, I will tell you that you wanna be very careful which seatbelt extenders, extenders you buy because most do not work in the Model 3. So in an upcoming video, I will address which ones to buy because I bought a lot that did not work. Just leave a comment down below if you'd like to know more about those. And now the last and maybe the most important part of protecting your Model 3 from kids, barf bags. Take these things, stick them in the pocket, and you, man, you don't wanna be caught with someone throwing up in your brand new Model 3 for a simple little thing like that. My kids, every time we go on a road trip, it seems like they're throwing up about something. So that's it, guys. I hope that helps. If you're on the fence of wondering, I have two or three kids like me, can they functionally get around in the Model 3 or is it just too small? The answer to the question, 100% yes. We've now put 1,500 miles on this car with multiple times a week driving. This has become our family vehicle, our large SUV. We only, she only really drives to work. Uh, we, every time we go together, we get in here, the kids get in the back seat. It's a ton of fun. It works very well. Absolutely 100%. Yes, it works with children and three car seats. So, like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, if that was useful to you guys, I'm gonna go through and talk about all those accessories that I put in my car, because I got about three times that amount in there right now. I'm gonna put together a detailed list of all that stuff and show you what they are, so you guys can see that in an upcoming video. Because some of the stuff I maybe wouldn't recommend now that I've used it for a while. So stay tuned for that video. Please leave a comment down below and let me know what more you guys wanna see. I've got a whole about 50 different videos I'm gonna be putting together on things I've done to make the functionality of that Model 3 top notch. And do me a favor, like I mentioned in the beginning, go down and just tap that subscribe button for me and give me a like on this video if it in any way helped you or provided value to you. Mean a lot to this channel. See you guys on the next video.